Hey, Kaka Tsua from growwithlanka.com. I'm going to show you today how to go live on Facebook from your page, personal profile, or group with pre recorded videos. So stay tuned. So, first of all, what you need to do is on Google type OBS Studio. That's a free software we are going to use. It's the first link, obsproject.com. And you have to download whatever system you're using that version for yourself. When you do and you install the software to your computer, this is what it's gonna look like. So at this point, let me just maybe delete this so you can see how I did this. So you click on the scene, click plus, name it, let's say Facebook Live. I usually name where I'm broadcasting from and I have my video stored at that either page, profile, personal one or group. So Facebook page, I click on edit with source and I go to media source where I'll type the name of the video, grow your online business, let's say, this just for me, and this will let me browse my computer and actually download the video that I want to broadcast. So I'll play OK. Now you need to scratch that eye, just click on the eye and it will not play yet, okay? So at this point, you need to go to settings, stream, and you need this stream key from your Facebook Live. Make sure that over here in service, you have Facebook Live. So what you do, wherever you will be broadcasting from, you click on Facebook Live, click on connect, camera is the option where you're actually broadcasting from your computer. So you want to get connected and you need this stream key. So you just copy and paste it into your OBS studio. So let me just check, it's the same, it's the same. I'm gonna click on apply, okay. And at this point, what I want to do is actually go back to my Facebook and prepare for my Facebook Live. So I'm going to write my title, Grow Your Online Business with Personal Brand. I would add probably something more to it, some emojis, whatever you are used to do in your broadcasting. Now, what you do is you click on start streaming. You are not live yet, but it allows you to start streaming. So when you start streaming, you will see here on your Facebook that this right hand bottom button go live will go blue. At that moment, when you press this, go live on your computer, you are live. How will you know? In your left upper corner, there will be the red square with the timer. You will see how many seconds and minutes you are live. So the second you will see that red rectangle with the timer, what you need to do is press this little eye and your video will play. That means that you are actually streaming the video that you see in your OBS studio to your Facebook. So again, you when this all is filled in, that means you're seen, your source, you upload your video and you have your title on your Facebook post. That's this. What you have to do is click on start streaming then this will go blue and you click on go live and the second you see the timer you click on the eye in the source that will actually play the video for you once you're done 
there may be on Facebook slight, what you will see, slight delay, just in a few seconds. So the second you are done in your OBS, you click on stop streaming and your live will go off the seconds off with the delay. So you can close your OBS and what you will see over here on your Facebook is what you see with the regular video. Either you're done or delete the video. When you're done, you click on done. That way you will save the broadcasting to your page, to your profile, to your group, and people can watch the replay. If you click on delete, that streaming will not be saved and people will not be able to watch the replay. So that works the same. So afterwards, let's say click on down, it will be saved to your Facebook profile. You can close the OBS and you are done. So hopefully this was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more tips on how to build your online business regarding affiliate and network marketing, businesses built online, help with social media and online communication. And I'm looking forward to talking to you next time.